Hi and welcome or welcome back to my channel and if you are new here I am TK and this is the fashion handbag channel and if this is something that interests you don't forget to comment like and subscribe to my channel follow me on all of my social media pages for all of my daily uploads so I just want to say hello to all of my Sunday Amazon babes we are back with our Amazon inspired luxury videos so I'm not going to waste any time for all of my new people that just stumbled across my video. What I do is some of the, I don't have some of the items and if I don't have the items, I just show, I'll have the number listed. I'll show a number and then I will have the picture of what I am referring to and then I'll give a little details about it and I usually don't give any pricing details because a lot of times when I post the videos sometimes the the items are cheaper or sometimes they're more expensive so I just refrain from putting any price from Amazon on here or shouting out the price because like I said prices change every day so I don't want to get you all confused saying why did I pay this amount when you pay this amount so without any further ado let's go ahead and get started with this video so the first inspire item this is number one and this is the inspired to the Hermes Loop belt bag, which they have this bag in black, gray, pink, and yellow. Let me say this. I have seen a lot of people, um, let me just say this. I have seen some influencers show this bag and they have gotten this bag confused with the Christian Dior bag. This is not inspired to the Christian Dior bag. This is a belt bag. This is inspired to the Hermes loop bag. So I just wanted to get that clear before we go on any further because I know a lot of people get them kind of confused because when you look at it, you would think it's the C and the D, but it's actually, it's not the C and the D. It looks like two Ds that's back to back. So this is number one and this is the Hermes um loop bag belt bag which will run you four thousand three hundred thirty seven dollars amazon has this inspired version with four other colors number two number two is inspired to the coco splash pvc medium flat bag and if you see me looking down for those who are new i always have my phone because i keep notes of everything that i'm talking about so this is inspired to the pvc medium flat bag blue pink color and this bag will run you on chanel for three thousand nine hundred and ninety five dollars on the pre-love market and amazon has this version and they actually have a couple versions they looks like they have um a pink one a pink green one and then they have like a blue one which i am because it's summertime and you know going to the stadiums and going to different events where you cannot take bags in they have to be pvc clear bags that they can see through or they have to be an eight by ten or how eight by seven however they go i'm not sure but i know like i said in a previous video i always get turned around because my bags are never right but i did a video on this valentino pvc bag and these bags like these are excellent to taking into stadiums and to different events that you can't take a handbag but you're able to take a clear bag so this is number two now we are on to number three number three is inspired by the chanel mini belt bag and a chanel mini belt bag will run you three thousand three hundred and ninety five dollars on the pre-love market but amazon has this version and i also bought another version off of amazon a while back ago which i had this on I think it was my number eight Amazon inspired part eight video where I showed this belt bag, which I am in love with this belt bag. You guys, I love that, you know, it's not available anymore. So this is why I'm showing you a different version to it. But this one, you know, I shouldn't be showing it to you because it's not available, but I will find another link to one similar to this 
just in case you girls are interested in this style right here but yeah so this will be number three okay so we are on to number four ladies number four is inspired by the louis vuitton hands bag which will run you one thousand seven hundred and thirty dollars Amazon has several different inspired versions to this, but I thought that this version was actually the cutest version because I love that animal print and they actually have one in pink, which is really nice, I think. So it does come in a couple colors on Amazon. I've been interested in the cans bag, but I don't know. I'm just... I don't even think that I would really wear that bag much. Um, I end up purchasing the Around Me PM bag and I don't get any wear out of that bag. I know it's not like the Cans bag, but I thought that me getting that bag would satisfy me from getting the Cans bag, but it really hasn't. Let me show you that bag. So this is the um, Around Me PM bag, which it is so cute you know and the back has the reverse monogram print and i love how they have the luggage tag and it does come with a strap if you would like to use a strap me when i did i've carried this bag probably one time since i purchased it and i don't know i sh should be carrying this bag more and I did buy this bag actually from a personal shopper and it was hard for me to find this bag. So that's why I went the route of a pers personal shopper because I wanted this bag that much. And I'm happy I have this bag in my collection, but I just need to get more wear out of her because she's just sitting there. We are on to number five. Number five is inspired by the Celine Triumph bag. And this bag will run you $2,950. Amazon has this version here, which they have this bag in, oh my gosh, they have it in probably about five or six colors. And I do have this bag, which I love this bag. And I wish that I get more wear out of this bag, but I just don't. I have so many black and gold bags that this has kind of been put on the back burner, which I wish I give this bag more love. But if you are interested in this bag, it is number five. We are on number six. Number six, I'm going to put this for my beach bag lovers. And I do have several bags. So the first beach bag is in, well, I won't even call it a beach bag. Let's just call this a straw bag. This is inspired by the Loewe straw bag. And this bag will run you $1,100. And Amazon has um, this version, which I think this version is so cute. I This version right here, I haven't actually seen this on Loewe. But it looks like they put this little emblem hanging off of it to make you think it's Loewe. But I didn't find one like that on Loewe. But the second one that um, I have, and this is the second one right here. That's very popular. And it's similar. has a lookalike to it. So this bag right here, I'm putting the two Loewe bags together. But they are from two different um, stores on Amazon. But I just figured trying to keep the beach bags together so that it will make it easier for you girls when you're ready to shop these bags. But yeah, I love this one. This one is one that I'm really interested in, actually from Loewe. And I do have, as I consider my beach bags, and I do take these when I go out of the country, I usually always use them as a beach bag. Like for my nighttime bag when I'm out, I usually use this drop a moose bag and I think this bag is the cutest. I adore this bag. I love this bag. I wore this bag in Jamaica and this is how it looked when I had it on in Jamaica and this bag just 
it doesn't get the Amish that it deserves. Like, yeah, it's little. I can't even fit my phone in it. But um, Jacquemus does have, I think, a bigger version to this bag that you can actually fit something in. But I liked it. I didn't want the big one. I wanted it because it's already pretty long because of the straw. So I just thought this bag was so cute. I also have another straw bag. Well, it's raffia that I use. And it's actually a book tote. And I have the St. Laurent book tote, which this one I wear all the time. I take all the time when we're on the beach. And picture right here shows me with this bag on the beach. A lot of people I don't think really use that one as a beach bag as much. But I think it's perfect for a beach bag. We are on number eight. Number eight is inspired by the Pauline Numero Noof mini bag, which will run you $520. Amazon has this version, which they have it in probably about eight, eight different colors. But you know, of course, me, I'm going to select black to show it on the screen because I'm just a lover of black. Number nine, which number nine is this, um, it's inspired by the Elenge Love Clutch, which will run you $940. And Amazon has this version. And I just thought this bag was so cute. And they also have this bag in, what, and actually a red color, but it looks like the red bag has like glitter on the front, so. I'm not into that. I'm really not, to be honest, I'm really not into red bags. I own, what, one red bag in my collection, and that's this bag here. And number 10 is inspired by the Louis Vuitton bum bag, which I did a video on this bag. I told you all, I am a bum bag, waist bag girl. I love bum bags. I love them because I like to be hands-free and you can find these you can't find this one here which is the one my this is my favorite the new one they have I don't like that canvas strap I love how they have the hang tag the um, luggage tag hanging off of it but I don't like that canvas strap I, if they had a leather strap on that I would love it. I would be more interested in it, but I'm going to stick with the original bum bag from Louis Vuitton. This is amazing. You can find these still on the pre-love market for about $2,000, but I just wish they would start back making this bag again. I think this bag was the ultimate bum bag ever. 11 and number 11 is inspired by the Christian Dior small book tote bag, which these bags will run you $3,350. Amazon has this version and it actually looks pretty close to the Christian Dior book tote. So if you are interested in it, this is number 11. 12. Number 12 is inspired by the Chanel DeVille tote, which these bags on the pre-love market will run you about $3,800 and above but these bags I love them for travel I'm really not a large bag girl only bag that I carry all the time that's large is my Louis Vuitton my Louis Vuitton never full um, and that's because I carry that to work because it's more of my work bag but I do have two a company sent me one, which I did a video on, and I'll post it up here if you are interested in that bag. And um, I also have this one, which I just love this one as well because it has those beadings on the front. And it's like, it looks like BBs from like BB guns, but... I love this bag. I use this bag a lot when we're traveling and it's pretty roomy. And if you are interested in this, if you are interested in just to see if this bag will suit your life, it's good to go ahead and pick up this um, 
to pick up this one from Amazon just to get the feel of it and see if this is something you would be wanting to splurge on. Because Number 13 is inspired by the Gucci Dionysus bag, which will run you about $3,100 on the pre-loved market. And Amazon has this version. If you are interested, I do own the Gucci Dionysus bag, which I have mine in which they call like the medium bag size, which <clears throat> I don't like this bag anymore. I wish that instead of me getting this size, I wish I would have gotten the smaller version. To me, this bag is more of the accordion style on the side. I'm just not, I'm just not a fan of this bag anymore. And this will be one of my bags that I will be getting rid of soon um, because I'm actually getting ready to do a closet purge. And I promised my sisters and my nieces that the bags will be coming to them. So I have several bags that I will be Sending to Florida to my sisters and my nieces and my mom. Number 14. Number 14 is inspired by the Chloe Abbey Lock Leather Bag, which will run you $2,383. Amazon has this version. It looks exactly like the Chloe bag, except it doesn't have the lock that says Chloe. So if you are interested in this bag, it is number 14. We are done with handbags. Now we are on to accessories. So First accessory I have, I noticed I haven't been showing you girlies any hats lately. So I wanted to find some hats that, you know, even though it is summer and it's, this hat isn't really summery. These are more your fall winter hats, but hey, I'm one that likes to shop in the summer for my winter items because it's cheaper, it's affordable. So if you are an off season shopper like me, you know, the girls that get it, get it. But we are on number 15. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just rambling. But number 15 is inspired to the Ruslan Baginski hat, which will run you about $384. Plus, it depends on what type of hat you're choosing. And Amazon has this version, which they have, what, four hats. They have a black, a white, a cream, and then they have like, um, like a camel color one which I have a couple of these page boy I call them page boy hats which I think that's what they really are um I have a Ruslan um, Baginski one and I have the gray one which I'll pop up a picture with me wearing it and I also have a raffia one which I never I never get any wear out of it. Oh, it looks like it will kind of match with what I have on today, which. Yeah, so if you are interested in these type of hats and you want to see before splurging and playing that price tag, Amazon has this version. And I do also have a version that's not um, RB, that's actually from Chanel and it was my first page boy hat that I've ever purchased. And I don't like this hat. <laughs> I really don't. Um, this one is actually, I have a big head. And this one is actually too big for my head. So even with my extensions and, you know, it makes your hair, your head bigger. It's still pretty big on my head but if you are interested in those page boy hats amazon has this version hey ladies we are on number 16 which number 16 is inspired by my favorite the van cleef and arpels magic alhambra ring this ring will run you over four thousand dollars on van cleef but amazon has this version if you are interested number 17 is inspired by the Louis Vuitton key pouch, which will run you around $325 um, on, off the pre-loved market. I am more of a key, I am more of a six key girl. The six key card, um, 
this one right here. I, I don't know why I can't get it out. But this is the one that I really prefer that I love. But I do have this version similar. But I have it in the black and gray reverse monogram one. <sighs> These pouches. These pouches are good to hold your cards in, you know, things that, some cash and, but I just think people really love these, but I don't love it. I really don't love this. I, I wish it, I wish I would have seen the Amazon version first and bought that version just to splurge, just, I wish I would have bought that version just to see if I really would even like these. And number 18. And number 18 is inspired by the AB Asia Bellic bag, which these bags will run you only $155. But this bag just, it gave me YSL all day long when I saw it. YSL has this, it's a, actually a phone holder and my fiance actually has one of these and they they're supposed to be like a cell phone case and they run you $1,850 and when I saw this bag that's what I thought about but this is actually inspired to the Asia um Bellucci bag um but let me show you this YSL bag that it just gave me the looks of and this is supposed to be like a phone case and this is what YSL is selling it as a phone case in my fiance he he has a lot of man bags and he has never ever worn this bag and he's just one that likes to spend money and collect things just as much as I do but if you are interested I the we all know YSL quality is amazing. The bag, the structure of the bag, or let's not call this a bag. Let's call this the, a cell phone case. It's beautiful. It's amazing. It has this, basically it's sort of, it's silver, but to me it looks more of a gunmetal hardware. I'm just not a silver hardware girl. I love gold, gold hardware. But like I said, that bag, this bag just actually reminded me of this and I think that this Amazon option is super cute and if you are interested this is a way to check it out to see if you are because those bags so small you really can't hold anything in with this one let's see it actually it's just enough for your cell phone so this is you know I think this is genius of them to make it more like a handbag than an actual cell phone case. So if you are interested, here you go. Okay, we are on number 19. Number 19 is inspired by the Cartier Santos watch, which will run you a whopping, whopping charge of $10,300 plus. Amazon has this inspired version and I, they have it in four different styles and in this inspired version of Cartier Santos watch. Here you go. Uh, number 20 and number 20 is inspired by, to me, this is inspired by the Valentino signature pearl earrings, which they, this is Amazon's version. Valentino's look exactly like it with the top, but where that top gold piece is here, like below the pearl, like on the side, it has the V for Valentino, which chef's kiss. Those earrings will run you about $545. And if you are interested in getting a similar version, here's this version on Amazon. Now we will go ahead and we are done with accessories. Now we are on to shoes. So. I do have about four pair of shoes and then we'll be wrapping this video up. And number 21 um, is inspired by the Tony Bianca Napa heels, which will run you $180. 
Amazon has this version here if you are interested. Number 22 is inspired by the Versace Medusa um, head charm satin heels, the platform ones. And if you, they will run you what, $1,315. Those Medusa, they are a beautiful. Valentino has a beautiful version to it. Steve Madden has a more affordable version of them. So it's your choice. Number 23 is inspired by the, um, and nine being Western boots, which will run you about $700. Amazon has this version and guys, I have them. I am getting in my Beyonce era. <laughs> I love these boots. I love these boots. I have nothing bad to say about these boots. So if you are interested in these boots, Amazon has this version here and they are good. Number 24 and number 24 is inspired by the Hermes Igory sandals, which will run you $325. And Amazon has this version and they have them in four colors. And I actually found another seller that another storefront on Amazon that actually has more colors. And I'm gonna link that below this one as well so that you girls can have a choice of which you are really interested in. So now we are on last but not least, we are on number 25. Number 25, which is this beautiful draped fringe jacket which will run you $1,130. Amazon has the exact version. And what made me interested in this coat, well jacket is, I saw Freya Killing with this jacket on. And she did it in one of her little try-ons where she vlogs. She's an amazing UK vlogger. I love her. and. I saw her with this on and when I saw it on Amazon, I screamed. I said, oh my God, I need this jacket. So yeah, if you are interested in this jacket, Amazon has this version and good luck ladies. So we have come to the end of this video. I want to thank everyone who stayed to the end. I know I rambled on a little more in this video than what I usually do. Sorry about that. I'm just in my rambling mood. But don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on all of my social media pages for all of my daily uploads. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.